Uh, hello traders, uh, hello traders. Uh, this video is about uh, technical analysis uh, regarding uh, the first solar, the first solar epic uh, FSLR, okay, listed on Nasdaq 100, okay, this is uh, FSLR uh, stock uh, listed on Nasdaq. Uh, we are looking at uh, the daily chart of uh, FSLR and uh, we, what we can see here, okay, uh, we're going to go quickly through this uh, and uh, monitor carefully what's happening here. Uh, for those of you who are new to us, uh, we are the TSTWSYS008 traders. Our website is www.stochastic-magdi.com. Okay. Now, on the, this uh, daily chart of uh, FS Solar, okay, we can see clearly that uh, the price is in a defined channel here on this uh, daily chart. Uh, if you see clearly here, the price uh, uh, first, uh, if we start drawing some lines here, that would make more sense. Okay. So we can perfectly draw a line here, okay, to locate what we call a horsepower trading zone. You can see that when a candle jump out, where we see a candle isolated like this, alone by itself, this is a hot spot a trading zone. This was also a hot spot trading zone. If you want to trade, we want to trade in a hot spot trading zone. Uh, this was a horse portrait zone. This was a horse portrait zone. So we can see that the price was in uh, this uh, channel here, in this session here, okay, and then uh, pop out of this channel, okay, pop out of this channel here, and then uh, start uh, a new channel to the upside here. At this point in time, uh, as soon as the price start coming out here, okay, we can see we can uh, draw another channel here, okay. I hope you can see all my drawing on this chart uh, because of the color on this uh, uh, screen now. Uh, okay. So this is what we have uh, uh, on this chart here. Uh, we can see clearly that uh, the price was in an uptrend this session. Okay. So it was in a downtrend and then quickly, in fact, this was a bigger range here. And then went in the uptrend and then went to the downtrend. Now the price is in this range right now on this uh, daily chart. This is a whole spot uh, a trading zone. If you follow my uh, course on this line, you can see that this is uh, a whole spot trading zone. This uh, uh, horizontal line here, as you can see, the price tried to turn around here uh, before uh, breaking it down. Okay, now we are at the edge of this channel here, projection on the top channel here. This channel was in the upside. Okay, the price was right in this channel. As soon as the price come out of the channel, okay, you know the drill now, we will project uh, the channel to the downside, equal measure. That's why we have uh, uh, this uh, second channel here. Again, we can perfectly draw the middle line of uh, this channel also here. Okay, so we have uh, two channels here. The first one here, as soon as the price violates the top channel, we will project the same size of the channel to the other side, which brought us to this level here. And uh, the price uh, did find a bit of support here. This is uh, what we call a hot spot trading zone. And also, if you knew this strategy before, this area here was also a hot spot trading zone. And you will position yourself waiting for a clear cut signal given by the TSTWSYS08 or the TST. TWS was a 008 trading system. Okay, so we are again at a horse spot trading zone. All we want, we want to locate a horse spot trading zone and uh, sit back and wait for a clear cut signal at a horse spot trading zone. So we are now for this uh, stock, a very uh, expensive stock. Uh, uh, this uh, FSLR, uh, the price is now at 147.32. Uh, okay, and uh, touching this uh, horse spot uh, trading zone. Okay, so if you go back again. We do not stop on the daily chart because we know now we are at a horse spot trading zone on this uh, daily chart. We will go quickly to the higher time frame using the stable data that the higher time frame commands the lower time frame. So we will definitely uh, pay attention to the higher time frame. We do not stop on one particular time frame because you do not make your trading decision on one single time frame. You do not do that. Okay, now this is the weekly chart. This is what we see for the FSR uh, on the weekly chart. We will start again on drawing lines on this chart. Okay, we draw our horizontal line here. The price again at a very hot spot trading zone. This is a hot spot trading zone. As you can see, the price touched this level very many, many times on not on the five minute chart, not on the hourly chart, but on the weekly chart. This is a hot spot trading zone. This line here are around uh, the zone of one 
150 we can see that this is a horse spot trading zone and the price again on the weekly chart in a horse spot trading zone so we have a hot post horse spot trading zone on the daily chart and another horse spot trading zone on the weekly chart okay do we go and buy straight away no we are not ordinary traders we wait for a clear cut signal to buy before we will buy the price can perfectly break this uh, horse spot trading zone and go to test this level of uh, 12500 okay Moving ahead, okay, so we see what's happening on the weekly chart. Okay, you can perfectly draw again uh, all this uh, line here. Also, if you want to, okay, now to satisfy uh, uh, some of the traders that are very uh, see, uh, uh, rigorous uh, in their uh, analysis. So we can see that uh, this uh, uh, triangle here has been broken and the price now going into uh, uh, horizontal movement. So there was a downtrend followed by a consolidation this is a typical market pattern trend post trend so uh, this uh, fso line in fact is in a consolidation period on the weekly chart okay so it's again at a whole spot trading zone uh, we will as always like i said if you want to swing trade or if you want to day trade you will trade in a direction of the market so for the first thing that you will check before you enter the trade is to see the direction of the s p 500 the direction of the dow jones the direction of the leaders in the market like uh, google and you pay attention to uh, uh, uh apple stock those uh, two leaders in the market plus uh, the s p 500 before uh, uh, making a decision because you want to trade in the direction of the market and the direction of the leaders very 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 important so you will first uh, do your technical analysis regarding one particular stock and then you will uh, try to trade that stock in harmony with the market and in harmonies with the leaders in the market do not forget crude oil and do not forget gold of course okay very very important as always pay attention also to the economy news okay check the news on uh, 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 google finance or yahoo finance regarding uh, uh, the stock that you are about to try to know uh, whether they are coming with some uh, warnings or whether they are coming with uh, some news okay so you know exactly what is likely to happen okay so you do not uh, go around and do your own things okay moving up again checking uh, uh, the the monthly chart for this uh, FSLR. We, we can see clearly here on the monthly chart that again here the, the price is again at a, a hot spot trading zone. Okay, we will draw again our horizontal line. This was a hot spot trading zone here. Okay, the price break this level, try to go above it, find a resistance hit there, and come back down. And now it went above it again. Here you see the price went below it, it went back again. This is a hot spot trading zone. Okay, as you can see, usually a hot spot trading zone will attract a high volume. You can see here this hot spot trading zone did attract a above average volume here. Okay, another hot. You can see again the same hot spot trading zone did attract. Okay, a, a high volume. So if you want to locate a hot spot trading zone you can perfectly do that by looking at the volume because usually a high volume will be recorded at a hot spot uh, trading zone this was a, a hot spot trading zone you see the volume again validation of the same hot spot trading zone high volume here we are again at a hot spot trading zone we watch carefully what is about to happen here okay again the price is a, at a, a support level here for this uh, fslr the price did go again on this uh, uh again on this uh, a monthly chart we can see that uh, there was a clear cut uh, downtrend now the price pop out okay and retest it here and go in uh, a kind of uh, movement to the upside here there is uh, a demand here okay my apology for this uh, uh, we are not going to start again uh, with uh, the same blah 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 okay bear with me now okay so we can see that there is a kind of demand here the price uh, uh, it's going up it's a kind of channel here we can perfectly draw a channel here on this uh, uh, monthly chart okay we, we are not afraid to draw okay we can draw a line as we want to um, now what i will do i will delay this one and then draw another one here uh, bear with me as i'm trying to play with uh, this uh, uh, charting software okay okay now is too big okay i want it to be a bit near here that's it that's perfectly okay for me now so we can also draw the middle line for this uh, uh, lovely channel here okay the best thing is uh, to let it go not a good one 
Okay, that's it. We have our channel here looking uh, up to heaven nicely here. So we expecting uh, this uh, to be going through this. Uh, uh, usually the channel is the sentiment, okay, and also the momentum. We know that the momentum is the enthusiasm of the market, okay. So it's one thing to be enthusiastic and another, another thing uh, uh, to go around and, uh, and trade, okay. So people can be perfectly enthusiastic, but uh, we want to see the confirmation of that enthusiasm by the price, the number one indicator. So right now, is looking up which is mean uh, is bullish right now we are the edge of uh, this uh, channel okay we are also at the on this uh, uh, horizontal uh, the what we call the static uh, uh, support level here the static support level here i do not put any uh, moving averages here or that we will be talking about the dynamic uh, uh, support and resistance level these are static levels okay so we we are now at a very hot spot trading zone also on the monthly chart as you can see the price of from the daily chart the weekly chart okay and uh, going down to the uh, monthly chart we can see that fs solar is exactly at uh, a hot spot trading zone and now what do you need to do all you have to do is to sit back and wait for a clear signal a clear cut signal given by the tsd ws a zero a trading system a top-down trading system a powerful trading system that you can perfectly use at a hot spot uh, uh, trading zone i hope you enjoyed this video also regarding uh, the fs solar that uh, you will put into practice uh, in order uh, to cream the market uh, consistently like i said before you will trade first in the direction of the market you will pay attention to the sector you will pay attention to the leader and a very very important do not trade in the void trade at a hot spot trading zone in harmony with the market until the next time enjoy yourself and be very happy thank you for watching and I'll speak to you soon